very clear to me that people with disabilities are captive of people whose primary focus is what they can't do. One of my daughters, Liz, is the reason that I got into the, the game of improving the well-being of people with disabilities. Liz is a poet, um, she's an artist, she's forging an amazing life for herself, but unfortunately people in institutions and systems look at Liz as somebody who's needy, somebody that they should feel sorry for or pity for, which is exactly the opposite of what Liz wants and what Liz inspires in people. Alec Mansky is the co-founder of PLAN, started about 25 years ago. Him and another group of parents of children with disabilities got together and decided to try to make a difference about their children's future. As the parent of a child with disabilities, I'm concerned about a few things. One is I'm concerned about will my son be cared for? Will he be in the community? Will he be a part of the community? Will he be loved? Will he be in relationship? I'm also concerned that his quality of life is good. We started PLAN because families were worried about what would happen to their sons and daughters after they died. For the first time in history, our sons and daughters with disabilities are outliving us as parents. And if Josh outlives me, as I hope he will, how do I be a good parent? How do I ensure that he's cared for, that he's safe, and that he's secure? People with disabilities rely on government services and support, pays for their housing, things like this, many people with disabilities. The problem is they couldn't save for the future. We realized that one of the biggest handicaps faced by our sons and daughters was their poverty. As parents, we wanted to help our sons and daughters out, but the existing welfare rules would claw back any of the assistance we offered. So we proposed a solution, the solution being a disability savings plan. The RDSP is a poverty fighting tool, it enables people with disabilities to accumulate financial assets, it enables parents to contribute to the financial well-being of their sons and daughters to have that matched by government grants, and it enables people with disabilities, even if they have no other financial means, to receive a disability savings bond. Al was a key person in making sure that we got just from the idea to it actually happening. Of course there's a huge team involved, people from all across the country, but that's to his credit. Pulling people together, making the connections, making the phone calls, seeing the long-term vision, but being able to do the hard work to get us there. He's an amazing individual. He has these ideas that he is able to nourish into reality and he thinks of things that don't currently exist and figures out ways for that to happen. He wants to have people with disabilities rise up and be a huge contributing part of this country. That's his vision and he's made great steps towards achieving it. There are times that he said we haven't done enough, I haven't done enough, and he keeps digging in and imagining even bigger, even better. My dream is to break the poverty cycle. Uh, for people with disabilities and enable people with disabilities to not only have economic power but uh, social and indeed political power.